everyone, I'm Christine. Welcome to Adult DIY. Today we will be making a sunshine mug. So basically what we're going to be doing is we're going to be making a, a sun out of clay and then you bake it in the oven for 15 minutes and then you glue it to the mug. So in your kit you should have gotten a mug um, and some glue. Uh, we'll, we're using this uh, E6000 um, transparent um, industrial strength adhesive and then some yellow um, clay and some instructions. Um, you will need a baking sheet and an oven and also oven mitts. Okay, so to get started, first we're going to sculpt the sun. Um, so first we'll start off with um, just about this much of clay and just start to knead it in your hands to make it nice and soft and pliable. Um, just make it so it um, is easy to mold. And then what we're going to do is use our hands, uh, rub it in a circular motion between your palms to make a circle. You want it to be nice and smooth. So we're going to make a, like a little ball, a sphere. Okay, so once you have a little ball, we're going to press it down into a circle, a little disc. Just press it, you want to press it evenly. Flatten it like that. Um, you can flip it over. Once you're satisfied with your um, circle, you can kind of uh, take your mug over and measure it to, to see if it will, if it's big enough for you. Um, keep in mind we're going to do um, rays as well. Um, so I like that, I think that looks nice. Um, so I'm gonna put the mug aside and I'm also gonna put the disc aside. Next we're gonna make the rays. So this one you just need like a little pinch of clay and then you're just gonna roll it like this and you can um, put it on the your surface. Oh, uh, you wanna work on a, a surface um, either, like I put a piece of paper down, you can use a cutting board, um, just be careful of the surface you're working on. So you just roll it out to the length that you want. Um, my design, I want to make um, uh, different, different lengths, so I'm gonna make some that are about two inches and then some that are a little bit shorter like that. Um, I pre-rolled mine. You can just roll them to your to, to the length that you like. And then once you're done, um, so I have a total of 16 um, sunbeams, sun rays, and I'm going to arrange them around this circular disc um, that we made. Um, but you can do however many you like. So just, you know, you can sculpt the clay however you like that to make um, sun rays. I liked these thin ones and I'm doing alternating um, long and short. So I'm just gonna pick a side and just apply it to the, the disc and just smush it in there. All right, so like I said, I'm alternating the sizes. So I'm gonna do long and short. And I've pre-rolled mine just so, you know, we're not here all day with me just rolling clay. Right. And what's great about the clay is if you mess up or you don't like your design, you can just start over. Um, so it's nice, before you bake it, you get a little bit of flexibility. So I ended up not using all the ones that I made, um, which is fine. So I've done my sunshine, my sun with the rays. Um, and then what I'm going to do is carefully lift it up and then flip it around. And then that's how it looks. So I like it. You can add more. Um, you can make your the rays um, longer or thicker if you want. Um, you know, however 
whatever you like to do. So next, what we're gonna do is take the mug and we're gonna arrange the sunshine or the sun onto it. Um, keep in mind you want to make sure, so I'm right-handed, I drink my coffee with my right hand, so I was thinking the sunshine will be facing everybody. Um, so just keep in mind where you're putting your sun so you're, you can enjoy it. Maybe you want the sunshine facing you when you're drinking coffee, whatever you like. Um, okay, so you're just going to stick it onto the mug and just press it into the mug like that. Okay, so now we're just shaping it. Okay, so the next part, we get to bake the mug in the oven. So you want to set your um, the temperature, um, preheat your oven to 275 degrees Fahrenheit. Then once it's preheated, you're going to just put the mug just like this onto a cookie sheet or baking sheet and put it in the oven for 15 minutes. Um, and then the clay will set. It will, um, it's not going to stick onto the mug. We're just um, hardening, uh, setting the clay, and then also making it into the shape that it will be easy to glue onto the mug. So 15 minutes, 275 degrees Fahrenheit, and then when it comes out of the oven, you just take carefully take it off of the mug. I've already done this part, so I have my sunbeam over here, sunshine, sun, and then, um, so you're just going to carefully take it off of the mug, and then we have to glue it. Obviously, do not handle the mug when it is fresh out of the oven. It will be too hot. Just let it cool, um, which will take like 15 minutes or so. Um, and then we're going to use this fancy glue. Okay, so try not to get the glue on your fingers. Um, you can use, I ha I'm just going to go for it, but you can also use like a utensil, like a, like a butter knife or something or a paintbrush to apply it. Uh, I'm going to do it to the center first. So this takes, this glue will take about 10 minutes to set and then 24 to 72 hours to um, really be permanent. So it takes a little bit of time to dry. All right, so yeah, I'm going to use my little butter knife to spread it out. Whoops. And I'm going to go ahead and glue the rays just carefully. This is very strong glue, so you want to make sure your surface is protected so you don't get the permanent adhesive onto the a surface that you don't want permanent ad adhesive on. And then once the the mug is dry, you definitely want to just hand wash it. This is not dishwasher safe. Okay, just a couple more to go. the glue. Bring back my mug. Ah. All right, here we go. Gluing the sun onto the mug. Carefully, carefully, carefully. Okay. There we go. Okay, so go ahead and press it onto the mug. And remember, it takes ten minutes to um, ten minutes to set, and twenty-four hours at least to dry um, totally, and seventy-two hours. So they recommend twenty-four to seventy-two hours um, to let it to make sure that it's totally on the mug. All right, and you want to let it dry just like this. Don't put it this way. Give it a chance to set, and there you go. That's our sunshine mug. Um, thank you for joining me today. Um, if you have any questions, please email at askref at elmwoodparklibrary.org 
um, look out for our um, next set of crafts for the spring, March, April, and May. We're moving to a Saturday if you'd like to join us in person. Um, it'll be the last Saturday of the month, so the next one is March 26th, and we're going to be making peep keychains. So we're going to be doing a little bit of sewing, a little bit of cutting on felt, um, and then you'll have a nice little uh, peep Easter bunny uh, keychain like the marshmallow peeps. Okay, thank you so much for joining me. Again, when you're done with your mug, please send it to Ask Ref. Please send a picture of it to askref at elmwoodparklibrary.org. And thank you so much for joining me today. Um, and I'll see you next time. Bye.